Estimated Date of Confinement, Wikipedia Audio The estimated date of confinement, also known as expected date of delivery slash estimated due date or simply due date, is a term describing the estimated delivery date for a pregnant woman. Normal pregnancies last between 37 and 42 weeks. Confinement is a traditional term referring to the period of pregnancy when an upper class, noble, or royal woman would withdraw from society in medieval and Tudor times be confined to their rooms with midwives, ladies in waiting and female family members only to attend them. This was believed to calm the mother and reduce the risk of premature delivery. Except in threatened pregnancies, lying in or bedrest is no longer a part of antenatal care. Due date estimation basically follows two steps. Origins of the term According to American Congress of Obstetricians and Gynecologists, the main methods to calculate gestational age are Childbirth on average occurs at a gestational age of 280 days, which is therefore often used as a standard estimation for individual pregnancies. However, alternative durations as well as more individualized methods have also been suggested. There is in any case considerable variation among individual pregnancies. Determination of which time point is to be used as the origin for gestational age. This starting point is the woman's last normal menstrual period or the corresponding time as estimated by a more accurate method if available. Such methods include adding 14 days to a known duration since fertilization, or by obstetric ultrasonography adding the estimated gestational age at childbirth to the above time point. Childbirth on average occurs at a gestational age of 280 days, which is therefore often used as a standard estimation for individual pregnancies. However, alternative durations as well as more individualized methods have also been suggested. Given that these gestation lengths are only estimates of an average, it is helpful to consider gestation time as a range of dates rather than as a single due date. The median is merely a guideline for the day at which half of all births occur earlier, and half of all births occur later. Births rarely occur on a due date, but they are clustered around due dates. A study of singleton live births in the U.S. came to the result that childbirth has a standard deviation of 14 days when gestational age is estimated by first trimester ultrasound, and 16 days when estimated directly by last menstrual period. Nagel's rule is a standard way of calculating the due date for a pregnancy when assuming a gestational age of 280 days at childbirth. The rule estimates the expected date of delivery by adding a year, subtracting three months, and adding seven days to the origin of gestational age. The result is approximately 280 days from the start of the last menstrual period. Another method is by adding nine months and seven days to the first day of the last menstrual period. Nagel's rule is named after Franz Karl Nagel the German obstetrician who devised the rule. Nagel was born July 12, 1778, in Dusseldorf, Germany. In 1806, Nagel became ordinary professor and director of the lying-in hospital in Heidelberg. His lehrbuch Der Geburtschilfe, published in 1830 for midwives, enjoyed a successful 14 editions. Example, LMP equals May 8, 2009. 280 days past the start of the last menstrual period is found by checking the day of the week of the LMP and adjusting the calculated date to land on the same day of the week. Using the example above, May 8, 2009 is a Friday. The calculated date is a Monday, 
adjusting to the closest Friday produces February 12th, which is exactly 280 days past May 8. The calculation method does not always result in 280 days because not all calendar months are the same length, it does not account for leap years. Directly calculating the days since the beginning of the last menstrual period, early obstetric ultrasound, comparing the size of an embryo or fetus to that of a reference group of pregnancies of known gestational age, and using the mean gestational age of other embryos or fetuses of the same size. If the gestational age as calculated from an early ultrasound is contradictory to the one calculated directly from the last menstrual period, it is still the one from the early ultrasound that is used for the rest of the pregnancy. In case of in vitro fertilization, calculating days since oocyte retrieval or CO incubation and adding 14 days. Mobile apps essentially always give consistent estimations compared to each other and correct for leap year, while pregnancy wheels made of paper can differ from each other by 7 days and generally do not correct for leap year. Estimation Methods Estimation of Gestational Age Estimation of Gestational Age at Childbirth Variability Standard 280 days. Nagel's rule. Mobile apps. Other suggested durations. Individualized. <laughs>